beautiful YouTube and this is Felicia from The Little Garden That Could. I am preparing for my fall garden. So I'm getting ready to plant my seeds and you know cauliflower only makes one head per plant. So I'm going to plant several plants. Whereas broccoli, which I have over here and it's already up, germinated. I'm just like really surprised. Um, can put many uh broccoli florets per plant so i'm not going to plant as many broccoli so um i put my potty mix in here and the seeds are so little that you just need to sprinkle them in the dirt and i just put a, a couple per thing And these are organic seeds. And I'm just going to put a few seeds per hole. Um, and then I'm going to whoops, cover each one with some dirt. And then if you watch, there's a video I'm just made about your own dirt. And so that's what I'm using right now. Okay, so I covered everything up. I'm moistened with this. <laughs> and get started. Water in. Ah, look at that perlite showing up. Can't quite see it until you water in, now, huh? Of these seeds. So yes, this is the time to get started on growing your seedlings for your winter garden or your fall garden. I also have my purple purple majesties and a russet that are late um, uh, late season potatoes. And I'm still waiting to harvest my Kennebacs and some more Yukon and red. Um, but this way I can get them started. I'm hoping to get them all planted by June 20th, my new crop of potatoes. And then they should be ready to pick by October 1st or, you know, cool. And then that will give me a second crop of potatoes. So it's never too late to stall your fall garden. This is how I start my cauliflower and broccoli seeds. And um, please like and subscribe. And I hope that you are planting your fall garden as well. Thank you very much and have a great day.